For Ed Pauls, simple everyday activities such as cooking dinner or climbing stairs used to leave him out of breath. Before I was diagnosed or anything like that, I would avoid a lot of things that I couldn't, well, I shouldn't say I couldn't do, but were a very hard chore to do. Uh, I avoided stairs at all costs. I'd take an elevator even for one floor. When I did finally land up uh, going to the doctor, they diagnosed me as a COPD patient. COPD stands for Chronic Obstructive Pulmonary Disease. It's a long-term progressive lung disease often caused by smoking. COPD includes chronic bronchitis and emphysema. The main symptoms of COPD are a long-lasting cough, coughing up mucus, and being short of breath. According to the Quit Now, Breathe Better survey from the Canadian Lung Association, up to 79% of Canadians with COPD avoid everyday activities like household chores or climbing stairs because of these symptoms. Dr. Darcy Marciniuk is a professor of medicine at the University of Saskatchewan and a spokesperson for the Canadian Lung Association. Chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, or COPD, is a condition that affects the lungs. It's as if patients are breathing through a narrow straw. They experience shortness of breath and activity limitation. In more significant cases, they can get a worsening or what we call a lung attack that can lead to emergency room visits, hospitalizations, or even death. Persons who smoke or former smokers often experience symptoms uh, that they don't know may make them candidates for the disease. There is no cure for COPD, but this is a disease where treatment makes a big difference. More than half of Canadians at risk of developing COPD have already experienced common symptoms, and 74% of current smokers polled show the signs of the disease. But many people don't seek medical advice because they believe their symptoms are manageable. However, when left untreated, COPD progresses at a faster pace. I've done fairly decent with my smoking. I've uh, down to about four or five cigarettes a month. And uh, I'm still working at uh, being able to say I don't even have any of those anymore. COPD is the fourth leading cause of death in Canada. Yet the survey reveals 17% of Canadians don't believe COPD is as serious as other chronic illnesses like heart disease and diabetes. Canadians need to understand that COPD is a serious condition. If you are a smoker or former smoker over the age of 40, you should speak to your physician about a simple breathing test called spirometry. Early diagnosis of COPD is important. It allows us to start treatment sooner and it allows the patient to experience less symptoms and a better quality of life. If you have any questions, I would encourage you to speak to your physician about developing a plan for quitting smoking. The Canadian Lung Association has some simple tips to help you prevent, detect and treat COPD. Get tested. If you are a smoker or a former smoker and you are over 40, ask your doctor for a simple breathing test called spirometry. Quit smoking. Quitting smoking is your best chance to reduce the risk of COPD. Take your COPD medication regularly. Work with your health care team to discuss your symptoms and how to better manage your COPD. COPD can't be cured, but it can be treated. Treatment can reduce symptoms and flare-ups and help improve the quality of your life. Talk to your doctor if you have been diagnosed with COPD or if you think you are at risk. For more information, visit lung.ca.